Hey, what's going down, people? I am out the Tenshi with another episode of On the Brain. Today, I saw X Men Origins Wolverine. Hot movie. Hot movie. Loved it. I did, you know, just like just like a lot of you, I did notice a few differences. But hey, it was a movie. Hollywood. As long as they kept, as long as they kept me entertained with the story and the action, I'm straight. Feel me? And Wolverine is one of my favorite X-Men. It, for me, it goes like this. Wolverine, no. No. Gambit, first. Wolverine, Beast. Um, Y'all remember uh, Jubilee? And, uh, what's it called? Storm. I, and, 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 and Cyclops. I can't just have I can't just have one favorite. I, I know. Um, love the story, but there was a lot there was a lot of stuff I didn't know about Wolverine because when I was you know when I was little I would read I would read the comics but I would mostly look at the pictures. I'm not gonna lie. Um, but it was it was you know the movie itself was hot. Everybody did an awesome job as their characters. Everybody did an awesome job. Uh, funniest fight. Funniest fight to me was Wolverine versus Blah. That was a funny freaking fight. Um, but to all you Deadpool fans, I can only see why some of you might be a little, uh, might be a little disappointed over the look and the whole, you know, the whole fight between Deadpool and Wolverine. Now I didn't know much about Deadpool myself, so I couldn't really have an opinion. I saw Deadpool's real look on a t-shirt and then again on a Marvel clip on Marvel.com and I was like okay this is what it looks like but I was hearing that he looked totally different in the movie I didn't want to watch the bootleg because really no offense but I don't really like watching bootlegs anyway um another thing is when I when I actually saw the you know the look of Deadpool and the fight between Deadpool and Wolverine I was like Okay, I kind of get where people are coming from with the whole look and everything, but I don't think that ruined the movie at all. I think it was just Hollywood act, you know, putting extra stuff in because that's what they do. That's what they do, and if people don't like it, that's fine. But you know, that was just one little setback. Other than that, other than that, this was a this was an awesome movie. The bone claws added more. Um, added more of a, I don't know, it just added more to it a little bit, you know, because just seeing the animantium claws was enough, but then, but when he was younger and then I saw the bone claws, I know that in, in, in different stories, in different comics, that didn't actually happen, but in other versions, it actually did, and I'm like, man, that's brutal. That was some brutal stuff. It kept, it just kept me, it just kept me wanting more, you know what I'm saying? And then when Gambit came in, you know, for the part that he had, they gave him a nice, they gave him a nice part. I, I just wish he would have, you know, would add more. But, um, when he came in, I was like, finally, Gambit's in here, you know? Because I've been waiting for a while for Gambit to come in. I went, I wanted to buy this, uh, this t-shirt of Gambit that I had saw before I saw the movie. And, but, I didn't, eh. And you'll buy it like next week or something. It's, it's a hot shirt. And, um, what you call it? The whole, the whole story, I just, I just, I loved it. The actors weren't like all droll or whatever. They looked like they actually enjoyed their parts, you know? Um, which, uh, what you call it? Um, oh yeah, I heard a rumor, and somebody tell me if this is true or not, but I did hear a rumor that the next. X-Men Origins movie is going to be Magneto. The origin of Magneto. Um, that's, that's, that's cool, I guess. You know, you go from hero, villain, hero, villain, I guess. I don't know the way they're going to be doing this. Villain, hero, whatever. All I know is they, they made a nice movie. Marvel, keep doing what you're doing. 20th Century Fox, you had a few speed bumps, but... Um, that was a good, that was a good movie. That's my, that's my opinion, you know. I have a friend that says, you know, the movie stunk just because of the Deadpool thing. Deadpool was only one part, okay, and one fight, and the look wasn't the same, 
but hey, hey. Hollywood, this is Hollywood, but this is also Marvel, and they got their own studio, so they're going to make sure that if you jack up their property, you're not going to jack it up to the point where you, no one can even recognize what the heck you're trying to do. Uh, but the movie itself was awesome. Big ups to all the actors, uh, you know, big ups to the 20th Century Fox for this property, you know. You might have had a few, you might have had a few speed, speed bumps and, uh, and a couple stinkers before, but, you know, uh, you kind of bounce back a little with this one. Uh, another movie I'm looking forward to, Transformers 2, tw um, 20, uh, no, 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 uh, DreamWorks. And and what and what else? Looking forward to the next Terminator movie. I don't know if I'm gonna do a review on that or not. I just did this one on the spontaneous tip because I just really wanted to tell you what I thought about it. Um Yeah, but anyway. Movie was sick. Go see it. All my X Men fans, definitely go see it. All my comic book fans, go see it. You know, um and that's that's pretty much it. That was on the brain. Thank you all for watching. I am El Detenci. That was on the brain. Check you later. Peace.